Who do you think is the worst at anchoring in the class? I'd say Ben. Ben? Wow. <laughs> ben, how do you feel that you were just called the worst anchor in the class? Insulted. Who do you think is the worst at weather? Jonathan. He said that so fast. Jonathan, how do you just feel that you were just called the worst at weather? Well, from Emma, so, you know. Who do you think is the best teacher in the class? Yeah, that was Donna. <laughs> how do you feel that you were just called the worst teacher in the class? Sounds about right to me. <laughs> Who's the worst student in the class? Definitely Mallory. Really. Mallory, how do you feel that Mr. Good just said you're the worst student in the class? Um, you know, I don't really care because I don't even like Mr. Good. I don't know. Hello Brownsburg High School, thanks for watching BHS TV. Today is Wednesday, January 11th. I'm David Bender. And I'm Balu, and here what's going on at BHS. The Anime Club will have their first meeting of 2023 this Friday. The meeting will take place after school until 4.30 in Ms. Frist's room C1410. Please see Ms. Frist for more information. Students, as a reminder, hats and hoods may not be worn in the building. The weather is colder, so we are seeing more people wearing these items but staff members should not have to address you to remove them once you're inside. If you're wearing a hat or hood, be aware you could be sent to ISS for insubordination. Please be responsible and move these items as you enter the building to avoid this consequence. The philosophy group will be meeting next Tuesday, January 7, in Mrs. Sloan room B1409. The meeting will be from 3 to 4 p.m. and you can see Mrs. Sloan for more info. And the Spanish Club will be meeting the following Tuesday, January 24th. That meeting will also be in Senor Sloan's room, B1409, after school until 3.45 p.m. Please see Senor Sloan for more information. The Academic Super Bowl team will be having a joint club meeting after school on Thursday, January 19th at 3 p.m. in B2327. This year's theme is the age of exploration and students can learn and compete in math, science, social study, English, or fine arts. All students are welcome to join. You can also talk to Mrs. Gabasino, Mr. Pratt, or Ms. Zod with further questions. This Friday the 13th is Worldwide Mr. Greg Day. Please remember to wear your WWMGD shirts this Friday to celebrate. More importantly, this year they raised over $300 to donate to the Refugee and Immigrant Center for Educational Services. Thank you to everyone who purchased a shirt to help raise money for this program. And a special shout out to Sophia Haig for all her hard work in designing the shirts. Worldwide Mr. Greg Day, Friday the 13th, wear your shirts. The BHS cafeteria staff is happy to announce that the, the rotation station serving line is now open with a variety of new menu items daily. They will be serving a build your own Mediterranean bar, Cajun bowls, mac and cheese bar, Southwest grain bowl, and an Asian noodle bowl. For, for more information, please check out the Nutri slide on the PCSC Nutrition Service website. Seniors, it's time to submit your senior quote. Your quote is needed no later than Friday, January 20th. The quote can be no more than 140 characters. Keep in mind these have to be approved by an administrator, no underlying meetings, and if not approved, you will not get a chance to resubmit. If you're looking for a club to join this semester, Environmental Club will, might be just what you are looking for. They have big plans and would love for you to be part of their club. They meet every Thursday at 3 p.m. in room B2428. Please see or email Mrs. Muller if you have any questions. Bring Change to Mind is a club focusing on mental health education and awareness. Come be part of the movement to improve mental health at BHS. You have the power to impact our school environment to benefit the mental health of yourself and others. In club meetings, they talk about the relevant mental health topics and do projects for the student body. In the future, they will plan school-wide events for mental health. Their next meeting is Tuesday, January 10th at 3 p.m. in B2402, Ms. Budzikowski's room. Contact Ms. Budzikowski or Ms. Lesko for more information. What classes uh, are you going to take next year? I'm not really sure. Man, you're boring. Well, BHS TV Clock Dormery has the scoop on registration and scheduling. It is now about that time when everyone is starting to get some of their classes for the next year, for juniors, for sophomores, for freshmen, and eighth graders, of course, as well. So, let's give you all 
the viewers a rundown of what this entails. Brownsburg offers a large selection of classes ranging from art to theater and even TV and video production. So every student has different graduation pathways, but everyone has the same requirements. So with scheduling, we need to make sure that you're getting the classes that you do need to graduate. While it's great for you to take classes that you're interested in, there are specific classes that the state needs you to take and that we need you to take, so that can all be taken care of during scheduling. There are three diplomas you can get, which are the Core 40, academic honors, and technical honors. The school will send out a link for students to complete open enrollment, so that will give you the opportunity to request your classes. If you're a sophomore, junior, or senior, you've already done this with us before, so it'll kind of be doing the same thing over again. You'll get a link, go into PowerSchool, request your classes, and their counselor will sit down with you and go through them. Counselors will begin scheduling on the 12th of January and will end on the 26th of February. If you need to know more, visit the school website and click the search bar and look for Program of Safe. There you'll find all the classes. And as always, talk to a counselor as well if you have any further questions. That's all we have here. And before I leave, one word of advice. At least take a class you might be interested in. It'll probably help in the long run. By the way, that's all I have. Clark Thornberry, BHS TV. Wow, I'm excited to pick my classes for next year. Yeah, me too, man. Nah, I'm joking. Now it's time for sport. Hey, Addy, what's the guys for today? Hey, guys, we've had a couple of teams in action already with more to come later in this week. Let's get things started with the swimming and diving teams who were at Plainfield last night. The girls came up short of the Quakers but had some nice performances on the night. Madison Day won diving and Marie Kingery had her best swim and won the 100 freestyle. Addie Hayen won the 100 back and Kate Shire had a big improvement in the 500 free. The boys defeated Plainfield 115 to 71. JJ Smith led the way with the wins in the 200 and 100 freestyle. Isaac Johnson won the 200 IM, and Parker Huff won the 100 back. Michael Williams was the winner in the 100 breaststroke. Nice job, guys. Both teams will travel to Noblesville on Saturday. Good luck. Here's a look at the upcoming events for our other teams. The girls and boys JV and freshman basketball teams will head to Fishers on Thursday night and the varsity teams will host Fishers on Friday, and the wrestling team will host a Hoosiers Crossroad Conference Invitationals on Saturday. There will be a call out for anyone interested in joining the girls tennis team after school tomorrow, Thursday, January 11th in Coach Field's room, C2-316. That meeting will only last 10 minutes. Please see Coach Fields for more info. Good luck to everyone coming up. That's it for sports. Back over to you. Thanks, Addy. That's all we got for you today, PHS. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, and we will see you on Friday.